Authorities are looking into the cause of a fire that broke out early this morning in East Windsor. We're told the fire started around 1 o'clock in a tobacco shed. News 8's Brian Spiros is live at the scene with more this morning. Good morning, Brian. Uh, good morning, Allie. Good morning, everyone. We're standing right along Main Street here in East Windsor. There's still crews here on the scene, but for the most part, we've seen some of them leaving. The fire is out. Now, we have video that we shot just a little while ago. We could still see flames when we got here. We're told that crews were actually burning off propane that was on scene. Now, as you mentioned, the fire started around 1 o'clock this morning. Um, the East Windsor Fire Department tells News 8 that they arrived here after a nearby cop actually noticed the flames. Now, according to officials, the fire started in a tobacco shed and spread to several nearby mobile homes in Red Hill Park. The people who live in those homes have been displaced but are being taken care of. Other homes in the area also had to be evacuated as crews tried to put out the blaze. Now, one of the people who lives here says she heard an explosion right before the fire started, although fire officials have not confirmed if there was, in fact, an explosion. Crews from South Windsor, Windsor Locks, and Enfield were all called in to help fight this fire. Um, as you said in the beginning, Ali, this fire at this hour still is under investigation. We will stay here on the scene and bring you the very latest as soon as it becomes available. For now, we are reporting live from East Windsor. Brian Spiros, News 8.